Hey guys, how you doing? This is Paul. And if you're looking into shooting video, here are five pieces of gear under $50 that should really help you out. Number one, the Samsung Go mic. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you'll know how much I love this mic. I talk about it all the time, and I still believe it's the best microphone for under $50 even better than the Blue Snowball mic. The Go mic packs incredible sound quality into a tiny, well-built package that makes it convenient for travel. It has three record modes, which are cardioid, cardioid with a 10 decibel pad, and omnidirectional. It even has a headphone jack for live audio monitoring, which isn't normally found in mics at this price point. So coming in right at $40, this is the best budget-friendly option to improve your audio quality. Number two, umbrella lights. One of the most underrated parts of video that's often overlooked by beginners is lighting. Lighting is crucial to producing high quality video. Not only does it make the video much easier to see, obviously, but it decreases the grain in the video because you won't have to compensate the lower exposure by bumping up your ISO. These umbrella lights might not be as nice as soft boxes, they're not quite as bright and don't diffuse the light as well, but they really are your best solution for this price point and you can get two of these for $46. Number three, the best light 216 LED light. If you're always on the go and don't wanna carry around large lights, this is your next best option. As the name suggests, this is a battery powered light with 216 LEDs. It comes with a hot shoe ball mount to mount it on top of a camera, which I found to be very useful, but on the bottom of the hot shoe mount, there's a quarter inch threading, so you can just mount it on any regular tripod. This thing features five different lighting modes and gets super bright, but the only trade-off is that it requires six AA batteries, which last about three to four hours based on my testing. To diffuse the light, they include three different filters, a pink one, an orange one, and a white one, all of which can be swapped out depending on the lighting situation. So for just over $30, this product provides great lighting on the go. Number four, the Graffiti Fluid Tripod Head. If you're gonna have any sort of motion in your videos, you will really want to get a fluid tripod head. And I've tried out many different ones, but I think I've finally settled on this one for a number of different reasons. First off, it's ultra smooth. I'm able to get buttery smooth pans and tilts effortlessly, and unless you have a huge heavy rig, you should be able to get the same results. Also, it's really easy to control. To loosen the pan, I just turn the knob on the left and the tilt is adjusted by twisting the handle. And best of all, it's really cheap. It's currently only $35 on Amazon and I can say it's well worth that price. Number five, the Joby SLR Gorillapod. This Gorillapod gained a ton of popularity after Casey Neistat revealed that this is what he uses to hold his camera in all of his vlogs. So even though I don't vlog, I decided to pick one up and test it out and I'm really liking it so far. It's much more durable and well-built than it might look. It can hold up my DSLR just fine. And since it's a Gorillapod, it can be used in almost any situation. So just like the LED light, this is great to keep in your bag for traveling. I'd also highly recommend getting the ball head bundle because the Joby ball head is surprisingly great and makes it much easier to adapt to any situation. So that's about it guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I hope I was able to help you find something that might be able to improve your own videos. So if you did like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe for some more content coming soon. Thanks.